Uh, we begin with breaking news, a shootout in Pine Bluff. This morning, police are looking for five men believed to be involved. It's all happened overnight at the Saracen Casino. While customers were still inside, TH11's Michael Aaron live there this morning. And Michael, we know at least one person was hurt. Yeah, Robin, that person is a security guard here at the casino. Of course, it is still open. Uh, it is almost business as usual, it appears here. So this is the parking lot out front right behind us. And this is where that shooting took place at about 1115 last night. That's when Pine Bluff police say they got the call. Police say there was it all started with some type of disturbance inside the casino and security staff escorted several people out. And that's when investigators say at least two of those patrons pulled out guns in the parking lot and then exchanged gunfire with the security guards, implying that those security guards also fired shots. We want to show you the five suspects who police are looking for this morning. They are wanted for first degree battery. Their photos on your screen right now. They're Tyreek Langle, Karan Brown, Brandon Burnett, Joshua McAfee, and Dontarius Slater. Again, all wanted for first degree battery. If you know where these men are, or if you know anything about the shooting, you are asked to call Pine Bluff Police. Uh, police say that one of the exterior walls here was gun hit by gunfire along with two cars in the parking lot. We actually had to drive through the parking lot in order to get turned around and get here to where uh, we're talking to you this morning. And you could see those gunshots on the side circled uh, as part of the investigation. And it looked like there were several, maybe four or five shots uh, to the corner of the building uh, across the parking lot from where we are this morning. Now, the security guard was shot in the stomach and he is expected to recover. We have reached out to Saracen Casino officials for a comment or to see if there's any surveillance video that they'd be willing to share with us. We've not heard back yet, but police tell us that they are cooperating with this investigation, that they shared surveillance video, and that is what helped lead to the identification of these suspects just some four or five hours after the shooting. We're gonna be here throughout the morning. We'll keep you updated on what happens here in terms of the investigation. But again, one security guard shot and the search is on for those five suspects. Reporting live in Pine Bluff, Michael Aaron, THV 11 News.